the first thing anybody who is visually impaired will first do is to learn how to read and write in Braille. Because Braille is a major source of information, it's a system by which the blind use to read and write. So where it is not available, it's a big challenge because uh, we are left behind. So those who are already 16 years, before they leave here, they're already 20 something. So from here, they start telling sister, I want to open an account, I want to open an account. And also that will not make us to start sending another staff with them. So it's better for us to have it in Braille so that we can actually get what we want and then use it accordingly. In our quest to drive all-encompassing financial inclusion, we decided to support the visually impaired by developing Braille account opening forms. Because obviously to start a banking relationship, the start-off point is the account opening process. So the Braille account is just riding on the existing account opening package, which you open, uh, you take, you read, you can fill it out there, but if you don't want to do it instantly, you can take it home, get independent help, fill it out and bring it back to the branch. Then we uh, take it off from there and open the account running our, on our existing process. The ultimate benefit is to ensure that everybody has the right to select and has the right to choose the kind of account they want to open and with full information in making that decision. The UBA Braille account opening form was produced at the Anglo-Nigerian Welfare Association for the Blind. It is a little bit process. Number one is we have to scan the form with some kind of application on the computer to scan it into text, edit the text, make sure that the text is the same way it is in the form for a blind person to read. So after putting it into the word, then we transcribe into what we call Braille. So after putting it into Braille, we send it to a machine called Braille Embosa, just like a printer for the sighted. So the blind own is called Braille Embosa. Also, UBA has uh, various uh, liability products uh, supporting uh, the, green, the green initiatives and also a couple of asset products. For instance, we have um, uh, loan products to women entrepreneurs at discounted rates. Um, we will continue to foster partnerships and forge partnerships to enable us uh, push in uh, our ESG initiatives. We will continue also to support uh, women empowerment. We will continue to uh, look for ways to make the physically challenged comfortable and bring them into the financial system and make them comfortable in their lifelong relationship with the banking institution. We think it's the right thing to do to ensure that everybody is carried along. Inclusiveness is one of the mandates of our ESG um, objectives. In fact, I would want to first of all uh, say a very big thank you to UBA because it's a welcome development in our country. And the UPA happens to be the first bank to take such steps. We now understand that um, you have us in mind, and um, it gives us an opportunity to know the kind of information we require to fill for opening an account in your bank. I am super excited. Um, when we started off this, I thought, um, you know, uh, it's, it was going to take that long, but I'm super excited. I, I think on a scale of one to 10, you can say I'm 10 over 10 excited. When this thing now is available, this uh, Braille account opening is available, you just to say, oh yeah, go to the bank and get the account and fill your form and submit, and that's fine. So I'm happy to hear that. And I'm sure when I say it to the children, they'll be excited too about it.